that was an amazing experience. I mean, uh, it was very fun uh, to be able to drive the first time with this kind of a car on uh, Monaco GP track. Um, it was very interesting. You know, it's a very complex car in total um, with the gears and everything. It's, the principle is the same as, as the old car, as uh, the new car, sorry. But uh, if you think that this one is nearly 100 years older than I am, it's, uh, it's quite, yeah, quite, quite interesting and quite crazy to think about it. Uh, there is no particular corner, but uh, I think that, you know, with this car, it's, uh, I think every corner gets a bit of a tricky corner because it's, yeah, uh, you know, the highs are quite high and everything, so you feel the lean. Uh, but we were also not going so fast, so, you know, we were keeping it easy. I drove with this one, I think, just about 50 kph, and it was already, you know, like sitting up there. You know, if you're used to a normal road car these days, uh, and then to to go into a car like this, I think the difference is quite big. Um, but at the end, the little key points are the same. For me, this one, the first time I saw it, it looked just like a you know normal road car back then. But actually, it's a racing car. So if you think, uh, you know. We started with this and where we are now, I think that the, yeah, the evolution that happened uh, is massive. Mercedes-Benz, the best or nothing.